हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू द क्लास फॉर ओरल्स मरीन हब यूट्यूब चैनल टुडे वी विल डिस्कस हाउ टू स्टार्ट द अल्फा लवाल प्यूरिफायर एस ए एट फाइव वन मॉडल एंड इन द नेक्स्ट टेन मिनट्स वी विल बी कम्प्लीटली अंडरस्टैंडिंग हाउ टू स्टार्ट द अल्फा लवाल प्यूरीफायर फॉर द एच एफ ओ प्यूरीफिकेशन सो यू कैन सी हेयर दिस इज द पैनल एंड द प्यूरीफायर विद द इंस्ट्रक्शन फॉर द ऑपरेशन दिस इज द heat pump inlet and outlet valves so this is the inlet valve for the oil and this is the outlet valve for the hfo feed pump okay now both valves are open moving towards the air and the water supply this is the air supply line which i opened and now we will open the water supply fine so now oil is on the air is on the water is on next we have to uh, start the heater so this is a steam line going to the heater the inlet and the outlet so i will open the inlet valve for the heater this is the auto controller the heater auto uh, variable auto controller so this is the panel operation panel for purifier this is the feed pump so i pressed and it started the feed pump you can see the indication green the feed pump is started next i will go and start the heater now the heater is on the led is showing display so now feed pump is started along with the temperature the you can check the temp, uh, parameters of pressure pt1 inlet temperature uh, pressure you can see here now the temperature is rising slowly uh, from uh, 77 78 so we open the steam sub uh, the steam supply oil sump level we will also check so that there are three notches so you can see here to the two markings the oil is present so the level in the oil sump is good moving further we can see the temperature is uh right now temperature of the oil is cold so it is right now 75 but since we have opened the heating it will increase you can see here 75 then 77 it will increase okay then minimum temperature for purification is now 70 plus so we'll press the separation it will ask the question assembled according to the manual if yes press plus if no press minus it will all ask uh, multiple questions so pressing the separation okay the bowl has been dismantled as per the manual yes plus next uh next after pressing the uh, plus we will go okay next question is bowl cleaned yes or no yes plus next start the separator right now the ammeter is showing zero and when i press it will show sudden increase in the the amps there is a starting current so you can see here the amps are here is 25 to 27 so that's okay now the uh, purifier is running and you can well see that uh, that rpm is increasing and now you will hear a uh, vibrating that is a critical rpm sound that comes approximately between 1200 to 1800 rpm and that is normal in any purifier so now all the leds are on and the temperature is also increased up to 80 degrees that is very good for purification and we will go up to 90 degrees now the pt1 pt4 pt5 and the water transducer value will all be adjusted in the purifier now the rpm you can see well it is increasing and also the amps have come down to like in between it is running 20 to 25 because rpm we will go up to 7800 so still the purifier is running and when it becomes stable then the amps will reduce so this is normal and you can refer your respective manual how much is the starting current for your purifier so it is reached now 6000 rpm okay and uh, just an observe 
observation if you find very abnormal noise just stop the purifier instantly don't take risks this is a water block and the sonnet walls so all parameters are good and the temperature will be also increasing and check for the any leakages and abnormalities so the temperature here is around 85 to 90 degrees so purification temperature is optimum 95 to 97 degrees for that check for now the purifier has reached 7700 rpm you can see here now that amps have reduced to 9 to 10 rpm uh, amps that is good our purifier is working good next uh we will monitor closely all the parameters for the pt1 pt2 pt4 pt5 and mt values so now the auto process has started and you can see well the solenoid valves 16 15 and 10 being operating and also you can well see the uh, uh it has become 86 degrees temperatures oil and the flow rate is 2.7 meter cube per hour the pt1 has to be 0.6 and above approximately and pt5 and uh, mt is also good below 100 so okay you can see the solenoid valves the uh, indication being rotating here the uh, sv10 is for the uh, filling water inside and 16 is for the valve closing and the 15 is for the desludging water now we have to check from every side whether there is leakage or abnormality is there or not now it is all good no leakages basically the pt1 value has to be above 0.5 if it is below 0.5 that means the filter is choked in the feed pump now gradually the temperature is also increasing increasing about 90 degrees good so you can see here the sp10 is uh, working so water is being filled up here inside the purifier and uh, that you can see behind is the three way wall and the uh, now 2.7 okay pt1 is good pt4 is also good pt5 is also good and mt is also good 88.6 if mt value the water transducer value lies between 82 87 88 so according to the oil quant quality performs the best quality the best thing about the alpha level purifier is it has got uh, nowadays bearing tube unlike the uh, gravity disc in mitsubishi purifiers this purifier auto adjust the interface with the oil and water now this is uh, on the recirculation can see here the three way valve is on the recirculation mode and uh, after the epc controller is uh, programmed the uh, three way valve is again get open now you can see here the sv15 got started and it desludged as soon as is desludged the amps increased because the ball uh, whole weight of the ball fell on the motor motor body so the torque required by motor increased that's why the amps increased so that is okay that is also the way of checking now pt5 is 0 pt4 is 0 the temperature has increased 88 degrees because it's desludging fire is uh, uh now again the operations of sv16 is going on that is the ball closing so that's good so now we understood how to operate the mitsubishi purifiers for more videos please subscribe to our channel thank you so much peace